Imagine a career where you create the future. A job that's never boring. That lets you design, build and test exciting new products. That gives you the skills, experience and confidence to work anywhere in the world. Don't settle for the ordinary. Consider a career in electronics. It's not what you think. One of the great things about being an electronics engineer is that you get to work on really interesting and important projects. Here in Adelaide, more than 400 electronics companies employ over 10,000 people. It's a dynamic, growing industry. And every year, hundreds of new jobs are created. Well-paid jobs for young people with enthusiasm and a desire to be the best they can. Electronics engineering is an exciting, dynamic, technically challenging career. The sky's the limit. Many industries need people with electronic skills. Defence, food, wine, health, security, communications and multimedia, to name just a few. A career in electronics can take you anywhere doing almost anything. Electronics is an industry that's growing all the time and I'm really excited to be a part of it. And there's no shortage of great jobs right here in South Australia. I really see electronics as an industry that's going somewhere. So let's meet some people who don't want to settle for an ordinary job. Instead, they work in one of the most exciting and fastest growing industries in the world, electronics. I work for an Australian defence contractor and I really enjoy my job because at the end of the day I know I've made a contribution to Australia's safety through the development of new products and technologies. The most exciting thing about being an electronics engineer is working on really challenging problems every day. Working with intelligent people and earning great money and having the possibility to travel overseas at the same time. I really do think this is a career for both men and women. It's not gender based. So long as you've got good problem solving skills, you're intelligent and you're willing to work in teams, yeah, it's a good career. This is a career for life for me. In the next few years I'd like to go overseas and that's something that's really easy to do with electronic engineering and then long term I'd like to get into project management. Well I always wanted to be an electronics engineer but I never expected that the products that I'll be making be used throughout the world in stadiums like this one. It's a great feeling. Uh, here at Quest we work on hardware and software solutions for the retail industry. Uh, these can be found all around the world and right here in South Australia. An example of that would be at a cafe or a restaurant. When you go to pay for your bill, it would more than likely be one of our cash registers. We really see it as an industry that's going places. Within South Australia there's a huge amount of opportunity, a large variety of work, it's hands on and it's a good opportunity to make some money. Uh, in five to ten years I hope to still be at Quest. There's a lot of opportunities opening up for us in the US and the European market and I'm really looking forward to doing some travel. Yeah, I always had an interest in electronics, but I didn't think it'd be this good. Where else would you get to test drive your own components? I'm a design electronic engineer at Integrated Electronic Solutions and here we design and produce the electronic circuits which go into the Holden Monaro and other cars around the world. Well I've only been an electronic engineer for a couple of years now but I can already see that I'll have opportunities of travelling overseas and bringing that knowledge that I learn over there back home to industries here in South Australia. Well, I guess I enjoy the challenge of working on different projects every day and hey, we get to drive cars like this. When I was younger I always imagined myself working on cutting edge technology but I never thought that I'd be here today working on projects that are protecting Australia and its national interests. Defence really is a broad term, part of which is communication. My role is to assist in developing new communication capabilities for the Australian Defence Force and other government departments. 
What I really love about this job is I get to work with some of Australia's most innovative scientists. I'm facing new challenges each day and I have the opportunity to develop my career and travel both interstate and overseas. I think this is a career path that has enormous potential, particularly with new emerging technologies within the defence industry. I find it very interesting and rewarding as I'm able to work on a large variety of um, components. Um, this here is one of our units that we make. Basically it's a 24 to 12 volt converter. It basically converts the 24 volt truck system voltage to 12 volts to run the light. One of the great things I like about my job is to see the results of my efforts every day on the road. It gives me a really good feeling to see trucks with red arc units driving around. I'm only 20 now, but in the next 5 to 10 years, I'm looking forward to doing a part-time uni degree while working at Red Arc. Um, I'm hoping to be, at the end of that time, a fully qualified design engineer. Uh, for me, a career in electronic engineering is something that sort of started when I was a little kid. Um, I was one of those kids that was always playing with Technic logo. Um, I used to love movies with um, robots in them, like Robocop and uh, Short Circuit. Um, and so it's sort of a natural thing that it carried through into, um, a, into a career. Uh, when I finished my advanced diploma, it was just a real surprise to be able to work on uh, real robots just like this one. Uh, this one pairs grapes for the wine industry. I've also worked on a, another robot that is aimed at the Human Genome Project and for me it was just a dream come true, um, something I've wanted to do ever since I was a little kid. Uh, some of the benefits of working at ARRM are that uh, I work on a large variety of work, um, so I've not got repetitive work. Um, that's a big benefit for me and uh, also that I work in a, a fairly large project team of, of, of young people. and. Uh, we get made to feel that the work we're doing is important to see the completion of that project and uh, that means a lot to me. Uh, electronics is just a booming industry in SA at the moment. Just look at the defence, wine, automotive industries. Um, it's not one of those industries that's shrinking and I'd recommend it to anyone who's um, keen about getting a career with the future. I've always had a keen interest in electronic engineering. I really enjoyed maths and physics in high school and it seemed that the natural progression for me was to move into electronic engineering at university. What other job do you get to fly a flight simulator like this? I graduated from Adelaide Junior with an electrical and electronic engineering degree and that has enabled me to move into other engineering fields. I'm currently working as a software engineer and I'm developing an operational mission simulator for Project Wedgetail, which essentially is a Boeing 737 aircraft. Being an electronics engineer, you're exposed to a wide range of opportunities. You can be working on a flight simulator like this one minute, and then the next minute you can be working on something else. It's really challenging and satisfying work, and I really would like to see more young women taking the opportunities as I have. Working for an international company like BAE Systems, there are many opportunities to travel overseas as well as within Australia. In any event, I would really love to work as a senior project manager looking after major projects. If you want to find out more, visit the Electronics Industry Association website. It's got heaps of information about job opportunities, employers and what you need to do to get a job that's out of the ordinary. <laughs>